Okay, in this next query, I want to show you how to compare two tables and determine which records might be in one table that are not in a different table. So I'd like to, I have my customers table over here and I have my orders table over here. I'd like to see if there's any records in the customers table that don't have a matching order in the orders table. There's actually a, a wizard that can help you with that. We're going to pick on the create menu and then we're going to come over here and we're going to pick on the query wizard. Now there's one that says find unmatched query wizard. All right, that's exactly what you want to choose. We're going to click on OK. The query you create will list records in the table you select below that have no related records in the table you select on the next screen. For example, you can find customers that have no orders. That's the example that we're going to do. Which table or query contains records you want in the query results? So we're going to use the customers table first. So I'll double click on that. Now it says which table or query contains the related records. For example, if you've already selected the customers and you're looking for customers without orders, you would choose the orders table here. So let's do that. We'll use the orders table. Okay, I, I had just double clicked on that. Now it says what piece of information is in both tables? For example, a customers and an orders table may have a customer ID field in common. Matching fields may have different names. Uh, so we're looking for a field that, that's in common. In this case, it is the customer ID. So what you do is you pick on the customer ID from this side and you pick on the customer ID from this side. Like it said, uh, they may have different field names. Uh, this one could be called customer number. That happens all the time. Uh, and then you want to make sure you hit the double arrow when you pick both fields. And then you can see it says matching fields down there. So it actually goes back to something that's called relational database. Uh, I'm sure over the next uh, couple weeks, I'll put some videos up there about relational database. We're going to pick on next. Now it says, what fields do you want to see in the query results? In other words, when it finds the records that are in one table that are not in the other table, then what fields do you want to display? So we'll show the customer ID, the company name, the contact name, uh, the contact title, the city perhaps, and maybe if this is a customer who hasn't placed an order, maybe I want to get their phone number uh, so I can maybe give them a call and see if I can um, tell them about our specials or something like that. So we'll pick on next. And now we're done with the wizard. It, it, usually you would give that a name. Right now it's called customers without matching orders. That's a fine name. Of course you can change that. We'll pick on finish. It turns out there's three customers in the customers table that don't have a corresponding order in the orders table. So with that query we were able to compare two tables and determine which records are in one that are don't, don't have a matching uh, record in the other table. So that's a really quick and easy way to do that. Uh, the way we got that started was we picked on create and the query wizard and we said find unmatched query wizard.